locked into your set one collections non-sellable cards i have some great news for you to start things off there are a total of 271 cards available for set one in order to obtain all three diamonds from the choice pack you only need 206 this week we start off with the charisma series program that is the new program that was added inside the reward path there are going to be 10 set one non-sellable cards to add as well as stubs packs and experience how to complete this program you have to do each mission each moment and also the showdown if you want to complete it as fast as possible click on the channel playlist 23 dash starter guides has a playlist that will help you complete it all we can't forget about the april tops now program we are now in week three inside of the reward pack for week three we are getting ourselves 11 additional tops now diamonds inside of the choice packs make sure you select a diamond you haven't selected previously because if you do you're gonna have to contact customer support how do you get to 74 you have the flashback stat missions you have the pxp with week three players as well as the moments with week three in total you should have 31 set one cards that are unsellable from the april tops now program before we jump to what's next make sure you hit that like button red subscribe button notification bell aiming for 30,000 subscribers before the start of summer inside the description is the twitch discord social medias and how to become a member we stream at 4 p.m eastern and 10 p.m eastern events give you two more set one cards now these cards are sellable and if you haven't locked in any event reward i have a humongous tip for you they have started adding rewind packs. As you can see, it is a non-sellable rewind pack. And if you haven't locked in any of the event rewards into your set one collection, what I would advise you to do is pick whichever one of these five diamonds is the highest selling one, and you sell it in the community marketplace. And when you grind 10 wins inside of events, you go ahead and lock in that diamond into your collection, the one that you obtain from here, since it's already non-sellable my prediction is they will continue adding rewind packs that are non-sellable so don't go in locking in your event rewards just yet in order to be able to make some profit later on if you straight up don't want to grind the event which is a very fun event it's the moonshot event common pitchers against diamond hitters a great way to grind pxp or just get better at hitting you always have the option of buying the two event rewards that way you are keeping track of the total which is seven set one cards but these are not unsellable except for one don't tell me you still haven't finished the great egg hunt program like i've said previously you don't need to go all the way to 90 you can stop at 80 so you don't have to do the mini seasons egg which is probably the most difficult egg to do if you need a guide to this we also have it on a playlist 23 dash content drops you'll find the guide on how to complete the egg hunt program the egg hunt program is going to give us five this time not sellable set one cards to add world baseball classic program has 29 diamonds scattered throughout the reward path in terms of the choice pack you will be able to obtain each one the order you go in does not matter but for the reward around the world pack one we are not counting this as a diamond because if you got the rare round you most likely sold for stubs or even kept mike trout or whoever it was that you selected but we will not count it because it is not a non-sellable diamond team affinity which we finally have completed to 100 percent on all divisions we have a guide to that as well on the channel click on the channel playlist 23 dash team affinity you're gonna be able to get 30 team affinity charisma cards five from each division as well as 30 team affinity team captain cards five from each division the order that you go in does not matter in total 60 non-sellable set one cards if you're still not done with the xp reward path you probably don't play the game too much and that's perfectly fine i'd highly focus on doing programs that offer xp as bonus rewards in order to obtain all of the rewards inside this reward path you should have obtained by now three out of the five diamonds 
that come inside the boss choice pack four out of the seven diamonds that come from the world baseball classic choice pack and then four out of the seven diamonds that come from the charisma pack and last but not least they also have this captain pack in which you obtain all four diamonds that are inside of here everything else is core from the xp reward path these are 15 sellable cards so not non-sellable and the reason why i told you if you've only been locking in non-sellable cards you are in good luck watching this video you're about to find out mini seasons just has lefty lucy it gives you set one mark molder and you have until june 7th to complete and time is not running out yet but if it is going to be a card that you want on your squad just to be a card completionist getting it done now rather than later might suit you a lot more especially if they bring in somebody like randy johnson later on inside the game in regards to the rank program we say everyone is a pennant race caliber player so you're going to be able to get the pennant race reward twice one through the program and one through your rating so you should have both set ones inside the program we're going to say you're playing enough to get yourself the championship series pack so that's going to be an additional set one card these are sellable by the way and then last but not least the world series pack as well that is four set one cards that are sellable and then the around the world pack one the around the world pack one we do not count because if you pull the rare around and you don't want to keep it i don't blame you make yourself some stubs but we have four coming from rank in battle royale we only have one set one card i'm telling you battle royale despite only having one set one card it's worth it especially when you can pick either ken griffey jr or jorge posada both of them you can't go wrong with it depends on what your team needs but ken griffey jr if your team was butt naked would always be the option you go with battle royale only offers you one set one diamond and there are 22 days left for you to complete this program counting the non-sellable with the sellable cards you have 174 obtainable free cards and we haven't even discussed you buying cards inside the marketplace or getting cards from packs that you decided to keep especially the around the world packs for example so that's 174 you add two because inside of the collection reward there is jazz chisholm and there is trey turner that's gonna be 176 diamonds that you can get for free not having to spend anything inside the community marketplace leaving you just 24 away from having your second choice when it comes to these three diamonds but like i said earlier if you've only been collecting non-sellable cards there are a total of 135 non-sellable cards with trey turner and jazz chisholm that's gonna go up to 137 non-sellable cards this upcoming friday we should without a doubt get enough cards from the tops now program that is going to get us to the 140 target in order to get either chipper babe or pedro martinez which more than likely one of the three is going to be inside the wild card slot the reason why it's so important that there are at least 140 unsellable cards is because all of the cards that you have now gotten from either events ranked battle royale or the season one xp reward path all of these cards are now sellable cards for you in order to make stubs and even go after the live series collection if you would want to or use to invest for roster update predictions or just hold on to until a player that you absolutely want to buy comes out if you ended up enjoying today's content hit that like button or subscribe button notification bell aiming for 30,000 subscribers before the start of summer inside the description you will find the twitch we stream every day at 4 and 10 discord social medias and how to become a member have a blessed day and night stay positive stay Stay safe, stay blessed, and I will catch you all in the next one. Peace out.